It's just lazy. Hello, welcome, welcome to the official launch of the Oppo Gaming Australia live stream. My name's Grant, I'm from the field team in Victoria, um, and with me today we have Steve, also from Victoria. Say good day, Steve. Hey guys. Uh, we have Roy from Queensland, say hey Roy. Hey guys, how you doing? Karim from New South Wales, say hello Karim. You can't how see you Karim, doing? but you can hear him. Um, and joining us to have a chat but not play games. Happy he's going to have a chat with all you legends today. Um, we have Neil, um, also from the Queensland team. Say hey, mate. What's up? <laughs> What's up? And uh, later on, we might be joined by the boss man, Dom, later on. So uh, welcome. Please sit back, enjoy, chat with us, ask any questions in chat. Um, please make sure you do hit that subscribe button on the channel so you can get notified um, each time we go live further down the track. Um... So, as you may know, um, Oppo is the global partner of Riot Games League of Legends. So, um, to celebrate the launch of our channel today, we, uh, we're going to endeavour to bring you some incredibly top-notch gameplay from uh, League of Legends. We're all very talented players. We're seasoned veterans. So, this is bound to be an absolute treat for you all. I'm kidding. We're absolute noobs and watchers get destroyed by bots <laughs> is what I'm actually telling you. There's uh, Dom's hand <laughs> waving to us all right there. <laughs> um, cool. Hey, Roy, do you want to start the game up, mate? Sure. Um, ooh, so, um, oh, do I need to do anything right there? You'll need to pick. I do need to pick. Um... So, yeah, um, guys, throughout the stream, in between games, you'll see some splashes of videos made by our own field team. In fact, um, right now, you cannot see Karim, but in today's videos, you, you will be able to feast your eyes on him. Try not to be too distracted, though, um, as there may or may not be some pop quizzes throughout the stream, and there may or may not be some prizes up for grabs, so uh, pay attention. And, of course, yes, make sure... Um, let us know in chat if there's a any games that you guys might want to see us playing um and b if there's any games that you might like to play with us or against us you know kick our butts it's all fun um yeah but it's so, not gonna matter what they choose we're seasoned veterans in everything we are seasoned vet veterans in everything so you can strive i'm sorry i hate to tell you just to let everyone know i'm also a good commentator but just saying yes Neil is a fantastic commentator. He's, um, he's, he's, yeah, it's, it's what he, it's what he does. <laughs> All right, guys, let's crack into it, eh? Let's show, show them how it's done. Absolutely. Okay. Let's get it. Oh, Steve's a keen bean. He's already put up a, Proper question, what games would you like to see us play down what, the track? What games would you like to see us play down the track? Do you know what would be really cool? Uno. Absolutely. I'm, I'm, I'm keen to absolutely kick your ass in some Uno, Neil. <laughs> We'd, yeah, it'd be so good too, because if you're playing the actual like game on the computer, people can't cheat. Because <laughs> I swear, every time I play Uno, somebody cheats. This is true. Yeah, you know what? There's always a way. <laughs> The stack the deck with plus fours. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Um, but yeah, there's plenty of games out there that we could play. Um, who knows? We might be able to get a bit of Go Fish going in there. Go Fish. Go Fish <laughs> online. Could you imagine? Nevertheless. Is anyone else's game stuck at loading? Oh, there we go. It's moving. Yeah, somebody's got a slow computer. It only loads probably mean. Yeah, I How didn't want to say anything, Karim, but <laughs> <laughs> a little there. guys, if you are watching from uh, in in any stores and, and you're here hanging out with us, please let us know um, where you're watching from. First of all, good day to everyone in Queensland. How you all going? Thank you, Roy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> How's everyone going down in Victoria? Um, you know, it, it could it could be a little bit warmer. I'm not going to lie, but we're okay. Tell you what, Queensland's a bit nippy as well. Yeah. Uh, 
Yeah, it was sunny this morning, but it looks like the clouds are coming over. But um, do we have anyone online from New South Wales? Please do comment in the chat. Keep me entertained. Um, I've got a question for everyone anyway. Sure. Um, yeah. What Does anyone know what the Find series is all about? We always talk about the Find X2 Pro and the Find series, but who actually knows what it is? Comment in the chat and we'll, let's see what answers we get. I like it. So what what is the Find series all about? And what has it always been what? about? Is that what we mean? Exactly right. Fantastic. Yep. For me personally, I love the experience. Um, I had this one of the first Find X phones with the panoramic camera first popping up. What, what, what the joke is there, I was being serious. <laughs> and I'm <laughs> still laughing. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, overall the experience of the device is just amazing and something that definitely meets my needs. Um, yeah, be glad to hear what you guys all think of it. I mean, as a as a device, I think it's a just a brilliant all round. Oh, there we go, first death. It's how it's how I go. It's how I roll. Y'all are jealous. Look at us all concentrating. <laughs> Um, I mean, as a as a device in general, I, I think the Find X2 Pro is just a perfectly well-rounded device. I, I love it. It's a it's an entertainment beast. Oh, it, it sure is a beast. You can say that again. Um, and the entertainment-wise, you know, you're watching Netflix, you're watching YouTube. Jeez, you could even play Fortnite on your phone. Who would have thought, eh? Who would have thought? Um, I'm not. I'm not a big gamer myself, and I've been playing Fortnite on the phone. Oh, you've been so playing it. You've been enjoying it. Yeah, I've been. I've been getting into it. I started off playing for 15 minutes, and I got bored. Uh, and then each day I've been playing it, playing it. And now I'm probably playing about 45 minutes. Let's go. Time. Um, we'll make a pro out of you yet. Yeah, hopefully I can be a pro. Hopefully, hopefully I can get up to Roy's level. I've heard Look Roy is a Look Fortnite beast. And <laughs> Look at that concentration. Holy moly, don't die again. No, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna it's, die. Oh my lord. I'm good at this game. The maroon coming out of Roy. Yo, Connor, how you doing? Um, Warzone down the track? Absolutely, I agree. So you, you'd like to see us playing some Warzone down the track? Would you like to be joining in on some Warzone down the track? You tell us. 120 hertz Fortnite? Agreed. Yeah, Agreed. 120 hertz Fortnite is honestly really really awesome um like i said before i'm not a big gamer but the smoothness of that 120 hertz is just amazing i've um yeah i've got fortnite downloaded on the phone i haven't played it yet um yeah you, you gotta get onto it man it's, it's something to experience um, has anyone else played any games on other devices out there, or...? Not on other devices. I've played a little bit of Warzone okay. on the Find X2 Pro. It was phenomenal. Yeah, okay, so you recommend that downloading that? Yeah. Um, I mean, it's a it's a tough game at the best of times. I mean, so is Fortnite, though. You know, Fortnite, you'll be shooting someone at the next... Like, in half a second, they're 18 stories high. It's... Um, and I feel like that would have to be tough to combat on mobile. It's tough enough on a, on a console. So, from Connor, more on Watcher for Warzone. Would love watching the stream, so that's awesome, man. We can definitely add that to the list. So, Connor, whereabouts are you from, man? We got a few people online. Where's everyone else from? Don't be scared. Drop a comment. We're all friendly people. We're not gonna fight ya. Karim might, but you can't yeah. see him, so you'll be safe. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why we took his camera off, right? 
<laughs> Guys, if you are here hanging out, you have not yet hit that subscribe button, please do. For a couple of reasons. A, it's going to give you a notification whenever we go live. Um, keep up to date with everything and if we post any other videos on the channel. Secondly, it allows us to have like a much more attractive URL. <laughs> we don't have to be youtube.com forward slash xqpf33987. Just be forward slash opogamingau. And it'd be much more attractive and easier to remember. So please, it's free to Now, I don't, I don't know if Dom's lying here, but he's saying that we are very good at Warzone. Thieves Div 1. Oh, yeah, MLG. Fill the beans, mate. Are you that good? Oh, who were you talking to, sorry? Oh, Steve's Div 1. Yeah, you're right. Oh, me. Oh, yeah, right. Just facts. After watching me play the other week, I don't know about that. <laughs> what do you mean? Dom was very, uh, very confident that he'd beat me in a 1v1. Yeah, but Dom's confident he'll beat anyone in a 1v1 in any game. Yeah, this is true. That's just a bearded coconut coming out of the moon. It. <laughs> <Yeah>. Holy <laughs> moly! Oh. Uh, another one from Benjamin. Grant is a very good, very good at war zone. Don't get in his line of sight. <laughs> it's true, man. If I'm sniping, get out of my way. Don't be stepping oh, in front Dom, of me. Oh, Dom's called it. Just wait till he's out of this meeting. <laughs> Damn. I don't know if that's aimed at me for calling him a bearded coconut or for you guys. <laughs> little column oh. A, little column B, yeah. <laughs> i tell you what, guys. I'm actually watching the stream on my Find X2 Pro, and it's looking awesome. Thank you, mate. The graphics and the smoothness of the actual quality of the stream is just incredible. Oh, ben comment from Benjamin. He's also a bossy leader and uses the shh frequently. One time, Ooh. man. Gosh. Yeah, uh, here's a fun fact for you guys. This is something that I've actually learned recently. Um, and that, did you know Americans spend an average time of 5.4 hours on their mobile phones daily? Wow. That's crazy. Five point four. Yeah. Th that, that's mind, Americans. Yeah. That's Americans. So okay. bear in mind, you've got twenty four hours in a day. Eight hours, eight to ten hours, you sleep in it. Fourteen hours left. Five point four. That's on your phone. Yeah, it's um. It's crazy, chaotic. right? Any any of you out there that pretty much you know do your whole life on a phone? Well, that's, I guess that it, that it kind of comes down to that as well, like what you what you actually do for work as well. Because, like, what does being... Like, when they say, yeah, is that purely using the screen of the phone or does that also include phone calls? Because you think there'd, there'd be a lot of people who solely use... Yeah, 90% of their work day is probably spent on the phone that's, talking. That's using their screen. You, that's using the screen, so that's purely screen time. Yeah, yeah, wow. screen time. That's a lot, right? But that's definitely where the Find X2 Pro comes handy with the supercharge and all. Super Boot 2.0. Connor would love to watch streams on a Find X2 Pro. I bet you would. I mean, I don't, don't blame you. Um, Connor, whereabouts are you from, man? What, um, what brought you to us today? <laughs> tell him, Dom, tell him. <laughs> Getting shushed in the chat, Benjamin. So, talking about Find X2 Pro, what, what makes our phone screen so different? Does anyone out there know? Yeah. Uh, from Connor, he's from Brisbane and Queensland. Our operate from James Beautiful. Houston, who's your um, who's Lovely. your representative? Brisbane could be the Neil or Ben. Hey, or the Roy. Yeah, oh, a Roy yeah. store's actually in Brisbane. They sure are. 
They're in his backyard, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> so you just have to jump a couple of fence, and you're in big door stores, aren't you? <laughs> That's it. And there it is. There's me. Oh, look at that. Love ah. your work, Connor. There he is. Well, that, that's, that's the man you're talking to right now, Connor. Neil. I'm so glad. Now Steve and Don can see that I'm actually doing my job. Ah, so you do go to stores. We were worried. Well, we were hang on, hang on. He, he didn't say he taught him in person. <laughs> True. <laughs> Come on, man. We're on the same team. <laughs> Come on, I can't remember the last time I left the house. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you for joining in again, Connor. We really do appreciate it. So you're, oh, from, you're from JB, Connor. Are you um, are you in Telco? I mean, I know it's open sales floor. You will all sell everywhere. I get it. Oh, Connor, with that pineapple emoji. I love it. Love it, mate. Can't remember if I mentioned anything to you symbolizing that pineapple, but... Stay on. Is all I got to say. Ooh. Yeah, so Connor, Connor works uh, at JB Churnside. He's at Churnside, very Roy, nice. Roy may know him. Yes, uh, I Hey, Connor. Looks after the telco side of things over there and doing a brilliant job, as I must say. Yeah. Telco sales JB, you know, nice one, man. You know, you know what the most amazing thing is? When you walk through the doors, the telco's right there on your right and the people there to greet you with a nice big smile. Guys, I got a kill! I did the thing! Well <laughs> done! Got on you, mate. Job. Now go away, Roy. Stop pretending you're helping. <laughs> Sorry, Steve. No, that's okay. <laughs> Roy's just out here snaking kills. He left your lane to come snake him from mine. <laughs> that's what I do. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I just appeared there for a bit. Unacceptable. So, I think someone's AFK. <laughs> So we've got Connor from uh, JB Churnside. Who else do we have in here? Who are you? Where are you from? I've just posted a question. What's in the your chat favorite group? color? I'd love to hear your answers. What makes Oppo Find X2 Pro screen so different? Ooh. I've got a few goodies that I like. I'd like to hear what you guys think. For me, personally, I love the 120 hertz. Obviously, you know, if I'm getting into the whole gaming side of things, not the greatest, but I'm learning. Um, yeah, the 120 hertz refresh rate is, is something. Um, the whole display being smoother, image quality, and you know what? Just the user experience. Yeah. Love it. Um, another key thing about it, you know, this is reduced motion blur. I don't know about you guys, but, you know, especially when you're playing, like, shooting games and stuff, it's good, good when you're trying to kill someone, that's for sure. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, from Connor, 240 hertz touch sample rate with 100, the 120 hertz screen. Really Connor's on, on it. The money, mate. Connor's on it. Love your work, Connor. A question for Connor: Have you have you used 120 hertz to watch any Netflix or YouTube or anything on the phone? While Connor's coming up with an answer, I know uh, big special K Kareem uh, special loves K. to watch 
uh, Netflix off his phone rather than the TV. Why is that, Kareem? That is uh, just a better experience. The fact that it's like a little mini TV in the back of my pocket. Mini TV in the back of your pocket. Love it. <laughs> Love it. Um, what about for you, Grant? For me, I mean, like, the, I, I love the overall viewing experience. Like, not just the quality of the screen, but I think the quality of the audio is something that we don't talk about enough. Um, just the overall yeah, viewing okay. experience is just it's phenomenal. Yeah, great. Uh, from Connor, uh, he currently uses a phone that only has 60 hertz, so seeing something that with 120 hertz is a big jump for him. His mate has the 120 hertz, and it looks unreal. Again, Honestly, man, it's unreal. It's, it's an amazing. And if you if you're talking gaming as well, you think, um, you know, PlayStation Four and, and and Xbox One, they give you an output of um, sixty hertz as well. So, mm. if if you're gaming on a hundred and twenty hertz screen with a you know, um, like you you've already got an advantage over, um, over console gamers. You know, on, on Plus the that, sample, man, sampling not, rate as we well. We don't just have 60 and 120 hertz, but do you know the three um, options that we actually have? Ooh, I know I've, I've got mine at full pelt at all times. I know, Steve, you yeah, put so yours on the, the automatic optimization, don't yeah, you? Yeah, on the smart one. So it um, the phone decides for you what uh, rate would be best for it. So if you're viewing video content, it'll... Um, Sorry, I'm just getting attacked by three people at once. Well, now. sort it out, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, so if you're viewing video content, it'll put it at the 120 hertz where it looks best. Uh, but if you're just doing, you know, messaging and stuff like that, it'll um, it'll just keep it down low so you don't have to worry about um, chewing through your battery. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, for me personally, I just keep mine at 120 hertz. Um, everyone says it drains your battery, but you know what? I'm still getting over a day. Yeah, I don't really find mine. it does. Like, okay, sure, you might be able to get more than a day if I if I turn it down, but do I need it? No, the phone charges that fast. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I just throw it on the charge in the morning when I wake up, and by the time I'm ready to, to pop my bum at my desk, I'm, I'm good to go. So you're telling me it takes you 38 minutes to get ready. Get out of bed, have a shower, brush your teeth, have some breakfast, sit at the desk. 38 minutes. I mean, I'm telling you it probably takes me less than that. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the man's got it clued on, eh? He knows what he wants. Got his daytime down to the minute. See, I have my shower <laughs> the week before, so I don't have to that morning. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Save the guy with a $1,600 hand set. <laughs> um, I'll tell you what's also awesome is the 10 bit color display. I'll tell you what, I was looking at a photo that had an 8 bit compared to the 10 bit, and it honestly makes a huge difference. Um, going from the 16.7 million of colors to one billion over one billion should i say it's just remarkable um Can't argue with that. Look, yeah it just makes the image look smoother and clearer um and you know what the funny thing is i never used to notice that before this phone came out um and now i just notice it all the time when i just see a phone that doesn't have the 10 bit color display love it um, yeah, it'd be yeah, very hard to, to go back to any other handset at the moment, I think. I, I, I don't want it. <laughs> well, that's right. And why would you want it, right? When you've got it all in one, something so convenient, so efficient, um, something so slick, it just fits in your front pocket jeans, doesn't get stuck, doesn't come out with a whole bunch of fluff on it. That's actually yeah. an, an important thing, just backing up just a tiny bit. The fact that it's such a huge screen but it still easily fits in your pockets like it, yeah. it's not a huge device but the screen is just a pleasure to watch 
I'm sure it is, Grant. I'm sure it is. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Tasty, right? <laughs> Tasty indeed. Um, <laughs> nevertheless, uh, brings me to my next thing that I was going to talk to you guys about, and that's the O1 Ultravision engine. Now this is this is this is something exciting. Grab onto your seats, guys, because it's the industry's first hardware level video enhancement chip. What does that mean? Oh, I'm glad you asked, bud. So, long and short, it transformed the video viewing experience um, from apps such as Netflix, YouTube, Amazon uh, Prime Video, and achieves two things: motion clearer. So upscales from 30 frames per second to 60 or 120 frames per second. Um, and the second thing would be the SDR to high definition video enhancer. Best way to use this would be if you're, like I said, watching Netflix, um, YouTube, which I'm assuming most people do nowadays, but even your gaming as well, if you do that on your phone. Um, something that I like to do quite a bit is actually watch sports on my phone, and yeah. man, it is awesome. It's so unreal. It's like when I watch um, Super Rugby that's in New Zealand at the moment, it makes me feel like I'm there. I'm on the field playing. Um, I know it sounds stupid, but... It's true, though. With the, the increase of quality of the way they film it, um, and with the... Is it the HDR filming that they do? They there is so many like there's better angles. You closer it does like when you're watching on in, on a great quality screen. It does feel like you you like you fully immerse. You, you you're right there. Yeah, that's it. On that note, though, we've got 14 people watching now. Legends, on, a, a lot of them. Who's out there? Like Grant said before, give us a like. Uh, subscribe now. We've got some big things happening. Um, yeah, tell us where you're all from. I know Steve and Grant are from Victoria. We've got Roy, myself, Ben, all from Queensland. Uh, Kareem from New South Wales. Not too sure if Fernanda's online at the moment, but she's also from New South Wales. Uh, we Victoria? Also got Victoria. Mean? Sorry, Vic <laughs> Victoria. Sorry, I'm getting... <laughs> Being carried away. You're slipping, bro. You're slipping. <laughs> um, oh, there she is. Dropping a hey, guys. Hey, Fern. How are you guys finding the game? It's pretty, uh, right. pretty full on, isn't it? Yeah, I don't think I'll cool. ever understand this game. Yeah. No, like, no, it's I'm I'm getting better with it. It's it's definitely one of those games that seem quite like basic on its surface, but it, it ends yeah. up being so complex. Yeah, and like you can't just run around and kill people. <laughs> like, mm. You can't just rush everyone and kill them. <laughs> yeah, it, it's definitely no Call of Duty. But... It's not COD, that's for sure. Oh, Neil, you've offended Fern oh. now. Yeah, I know. I feel bad. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I know you can't go out for a beer right now, but you know what? I wish I had one here handy. I'll crack one open for you. Come on, Patrick. I know you're in there. Where are you? Drop me a DM. Oh. Slide on in. Slide in. Oh, This is going to sound really lame, but who takes photos and videos at the gym? That would uh, mean I'm going to the gym. Alright, uh, well. Uh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I play I video do. games, Neil. <laughs> Neil, I play video games, man. I'm, I'm... <sighs> What's a gym? You've got, you've got a nice build, mate. <laughs> Why, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I know Kareem does. That's for sure. I mean, I play American football as 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 a receiver and a quarterback, but you best believe next season I'm coming back as a as a big O lineman. Just scorching right, now, up. The, now, what I'm about to say is a very you answer carefully. What team do you support? Baltimore Ravens, mate. There's nothing careful about it. 
Right. <laughs> we'll have to see what Dom has to say about that. Dom's Patriots, isn't he? It's... I think he is, yeah. Patriots are the the Collingwood of the NFL world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, AFL... I, it's it's I, like I, everybody I hates them unless you support them. And, and I, I know people that support them and, and hate them. <laughs> it's weird. Oh, wow. Well. Okay. Um, yeah, NFL is probably a go-to sport. Have you watched the NFL on your phone? Oh, uh, not like. yet. The season hasn't started and the phone wasn't out before the season ended. Um, yeah, see, that was the test question. A true supporter would be on YouTube looking at highlight reels. And... <laughs> you, you think I don't know all of Lamar Jackson's highlights for the season? <laughs> the guy's a whiz. Come, he, he's exactly on, who, I, who I based my game as a quarterback on. Slow... And not so agile. <laughs> Is there such thing as a slow but very agile? Yes. Oh. Actually, I'll, I'll, the, I'll, <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll kind of chalk myself. Like, I reckon I'm slow but agile. <laughs> I'm slow but I'll get around everybody. Or I'll go through them, it's fine. <laughs> Your team. I was doing so good a few minutes ago and now I'm just... Doodoos. How is the game going? Alright, Steve. Steve is unstoppable. Alright, alright. I can see the concentration on Roy's face. He's absolutely <laughs> killing it. Literally. And my back hurts. Oh. Oh, it's a tough life sitting on that nice comfy chair, isn't it? <laughs> That's quite comfortable. I don't think anyone can see it. Not on stream, I can't, no. <laughs> Neil's got the inside. <laughs> I've got the inside scoop. Take that funny thing off your head as well. <laughs> is, that a, is that a stuffed cat on your head, Roy? What's going on? What are you uh, doing? Man? It's just my hair. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Alright, guys. We've got 14 people watching the stream. And we've got about four people commenting. Where's the other 10? Drop me a hi, drop me a hello. Who knows, you may even win a prize. Oh, can I win a prize? You sure can. Ooh. So who have we seen from stores so far? Just Connor? We've seen just, just Connor. Connor, yes. Yeah. And Connor's I... really, I think, may, maybe people are a bit put off because Connor's just, Connor's just on it. <laughs> Dominating. He knows it. He's... There he is. He's still watching. Legend. He's keeping his eyes on Love the pineapples. Work, <laughs> I love the use of emojis there. <laughs> yeah, it's like he's sending me a code word or something, but I have no <laughs> idea what pineapples mean. I'm assuming it's just a Queensland thing. Yeah, it could be. Or maybe my head looks like a pineapple. Don't know. He can't. They can only see my head right now, mate. So, <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> well, no, I met Connor yesterday in the store. Ah, oh, true. Maybe he's trying to tell me something. Maybe I got a fat head and only a little bit of hair on top. I mean, but you've got a different haircut every week. Yeah, look, I like to spice things up. With uh, everything going on in the world, there's not much else going on in my world, so I like to keep it tasty. So Connor's camping at the moment, so he's got really bad reception. Half his luck. But, I but forget you know what it's what? like to leave he's the house. still online. He's still online and he's still watching. Legendary. That is amazing. It truly is. Oh, I'd love to be off camping right now. That'd be incredible. Where are you camping, Connor? Right. <laughs> oh, I had him lined up for the pentakill, and Roy just comes in and just nicks it right at the end. <laughs> Can't let that happen. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn! 
Man, I carried. Yeah, you definitely did. Yeah, the, absolutely. The other team. <laughs> <laughs> I believe the term is beating. <laughs> wow. Wow, imagine copping that. Um, alrighty, Roy, you can get the next game started. And for everyone watching, we're going to flick through, flick to a beautiful piece of content that Karim has put together for us. Um, so you'll be able to indulge yourself on a few seconds of insight to the Find X2 Pro tri camera setup. This is Oppo's most powerful three camera system that chat. even rivals some entry level computer solars. The Find X2 Pro three cameras include one, a 48 megapixel wide angle yep. primary lens yep. or wide aperture. Yep. Uh, Two, a 48 megapixel ultra wide angle lens with 120 no, degrees okay, yep. view. And three, 13 megapixel telephoto lens with 10 times higher zoom. There's also a 13 megapixel front kill. camera. Now, don't worry about <laughs> the front anyway. still. Nah. Because the wide angle and telephoto lens have optical image stabilization for sharp images. All righty, Karim, thank you very much for that beautiful insight on the Find X2 Pro camera, tri-camera setup. Um, all right, we've got the next game starting to get underway. So, yeah, guys, please, if um, if you're watching Hangout, you have not yet hit that subscribe button, please do. Um, it'll It's going to help you get... <laughs> Tom's still waving from his, from his fan cam. Um, hey, Dom, how you doing? um <laughs> uh, yeah please hit that subscribe button it'll it'll allow you to be notified when when we do go live again and any future content being posted on the channel um also it lets us have a much more attractive url uh, once we get to 100 subs which i think we're about a third of the way there so far Ketchup's Bank <laughs> Boona, is that, that's a real place? <laughs> like, is it just a building where they store all the ketchup? I have, I have honestly never heard of that place. I'm guessing it's just a big building full of ketchup. Wouldn't that be awesome, right? Wouldn't it be nice? Oh. So <laughs> great. Uh, the guys are... oh, sorry. <laughs> the guys what? <laughs> The guys are saying that um, they could still hear me during the uh, training they video. They sure could. I thought you had it set up so we were muted. Look, during that. I muted it towards the end manually, but you guys are really making it hard work for me out here. <laughs> I'll mute it manually next time. So oh, I thought you just didn't have the input in that scene. That's all. Yeah, I can't. I can't remove it out of the mixer because uh, yeah. it's, it's desktop audio. Um, but that's okay. I'll um, I'll just mute it next time. Maybe. Oh, I just won't talk next time. I'll just go full Karim. Oh, okay. Speaking of Karim, where are you at, Karim? I am outside my house. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you just flexing on us Victorians right now? <laughs> Bruh. Of course. Nice little fresh air. Bruh. Green grass. Speaking of, what did you all think of Karim's fantastic spiel on the tri-camera setup of the Find X2 Pro? I think he looks beautiful. I think he did. A, I think he did an absolute good job. And that was very Sorry, good was words from him. Well up. done. <laughs> <laughs> I think my mouth was speaking and my head was still thinking. Um, sorry for that. Um, yeah, no, he did a beautiful job. I actually learned quite a bit of stuff from that. Um, to be honest, I think he nailed it to a T. Um, and yeah, like Patrick said, Karim spoke well and nice job. And he himself said handsome, which I don't know <laughs> how I feel Imagine about. calling yourself handsome. <laughs> Karim spoke well. Yeah, uh, imagine if he imagine if he was speaking in this stream, let alone speaking well. Imagine that. Yeah, look Be at wild. that. <laughs> Maybe he just needs words in front of him to tell him what to say. <laughs> Here's a question from 
the string uh, or the training video, should I say? Yeah. What me what megapixel is the front camera of the Find X2 Pro? It's a tough mm. one because we've only talked about the rear. But it was spoken about in Karim's video just then. Surely was. Were you paying attention? Have you been paying attention? Wait, we're going to get I don't know. copyright strike for saying leave, that? Leave a comment if you know what the right answer is. I'm feeling a little bit generous here, guys. Oh. First person to put in the right answer may win a little something something. It could be a bag of lollies. Dude, I love lollies, man. They're so good. Um, they're so good. I definitely prefer chockies. But I'll, um, I'll take lollies. Yeah, no. Lollies are... You know what you do. You get that five packet of lollies and you put them in your freezer. Yeah, it's a good time. Your what? Free, yeah, free, freezer pack of lollies. Wow. That's yeah. something I've never known. No, you wouldn't. You'd just, you'd just be sucking on the same lolly for the next... Uh... Five minutes or so, you know. Um, so Connor didn't hear the question, so I'll repeat the question. Um, how many megapixels is the front camera of the Find X2 Pro? I'll give you a few seconds to look at. Yeah, don't forget, there's a bit of a delay. He's probably only just heard the question now. <laughs> I like things fast. Oh. Speedy. Life in the fast lane, you reckon? You know what they say, if you ain't first, you're last. Who says that? Who loves that, who, who loves that movie? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So quotable, hey. <laughs> it's so quotable. <laughs> Uh, it, 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 tell you what, Will Ferrell is just an amazing guy. He honestly is. He just wakes up, doesn't even do his hair, and he still makes it to the movie. Absolute boss. <laughs> I haven't watched it in so long. Now you make me want to, like, Ooh. after work tonight, put it on. <laughs> Connor, 48 megapixels. Would you like to try again, Connor? I'll get, you know what? For, for... I'll give you another... I'll... Yeah, I mean, it's first person with the right answer he gets it. Yeah. Have another go, and I'll give you a hint. It's less than 48. Is he thinking about the wrong camera? Ooh. No, no, no. Type it in chat just in case he's... Um, the connections breaking yeah, up he, audio. Yeah, he is in some place called Ketchup. <laughs> so. Ketchup City or something? There we go. Yeah, see, there you go. What was the question about yeah. the, the main... Was the question no. about the main camera my stream keeps cutting out? Um, Connor, Neil's just posted the question above you there. So. There you go. Look at that, eh? Legend. Now, so I knew he'd just have the answer straight, eh? straight away. He's, uh, he now, just now looks Grant, like a man who knows what he's talking about. Grant, you obviously know what I'm thinking. Can you please do the honours and announce the winner? Um, and, which and one? what will they get? Wh which, which one? There's only one. The one oh. that there's only one? So we're doing the one that there's only one of? No, we're doing the one where you put in your ears. <laughs> right. <laughs> wow. Um, Connor, congratulations. You have won yourself a 12-pack of cotton buds. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Gee. Connor, congratulations. You are the proud owner of a brand new pair of Enkos. Um, so wireless earbuds. Um, so obviously Neil is your local Oppo account executive, so um, he'll make sure he's in contact with you to tee up getting those to you, mate. So congratulations, well done, legend. Thank you for hanging out with us. I'm so glad I got someone from Queensland, and it was one of my stores. How awesome is that? Rigged. Yeah. <laughs> pineapple. <laughs> yeah, it's pineapple, man. Pineapple code. <laughs> I'm telling you. 
No, it's not. Really. Use code pineapple I at the checkout. I, I got I got your back, Connor. Well done. Come on, guys. There's 13 of us on here. I know there's more people out, out there. Where are you all? <laughs> they so, were picking on me. Everyone loves the Oppo camera, right? Yeah. I know I do, surely. Um, here's a question for everyone out there. Um, does a pixel count alone make an amazing camera? Absolutely not. Absolutely well, not. You are fast off the mark on that one. You don't want to think about it? Absolutely <laughs> not. Okay. I didn't, you were you asking us or were you uh, asking I'm the just, people? I'm, I'm just putting it out there. You know, if you guys want to answer, you can answer it. Absolutely not. If... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, look, you're right. Because pixel count doesn't mean anything. Um, I mean, it's, it's, I, mean I, don't, I don't know about it. it doesn't it mean anything. It, it means something, <laughs> but but everyone know, everyone knows it's all about what's under the hood, right? Yeah. Or what the hood is made out of. <laughs> um, no, look, the under the hood is what gives us the amazing video and the photo capturing experience, um, and that's what the tri camera setup is all about. Um, you've got the thirteen megapixel telephoto lens. With the 10x hybrid zoom. Um, now, what that means is it's going to improve your optical image stabilization technology. Um, and it's a second gen 10x hybrid zoom with a smooth transitional zooming for the, your DSLR like zooming, really. Um, I know I was in the process of actually buying a DSLR and now I don't need to, I just saved three grand. You've, you say you've opted so, against the, the DSLR now? Yeah, I don't. I don't think I'll. I'll use it. To yeah, be honest. that's fair. Um, might as well just use three grand and put it towards my new driveway. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> um. But yeah, look, Patrick has just messaged and um, he said there are so many things that make a good camera, such as lens, aperture, uh, megapixels. If you want, print big photos. Software plays a big part. Yeah, you're exactly right there, Pat. Patrick, um, you, you sound like a man that knows what he's talking about. Yeah, you definitely do, mate. Where are you from? I know for myself, um, I take a lot of photos now. I never used to before. Um, especially of my son, who's two and a half years old. Um, and he's always outside running around. I know Ben will agree with me here. I know he takes a lot of photos as well. Um, it's, yeah, it's definitely an awesome feature and in the top three for me. Um, something that is so convenient as well. Just take it out of my pocket and there, bam, in one click, got the camera. Um, another key one for me is the 48 megapixel ultra wide angle lens. Um, here's a sneaky question for you. Oh, sneaky one. Sneaky one. Is it 119? Is it 119 degree wide angle or is it 120 degree wide angle? Love to see answers in the chat. Mm. Um, but yeah, the, and also using the three centimeter. Sorry, 3CM Ultra Macro Mode. I tell you what, guys, something you need to do is go into your local Coles or Woolies, um, get a piece of kiwi fruit, and use this feature. You and your kiwi Ooh, fruit, cool. man. Hey. Oh, it's awesome. I, I like using the Ultra Macro Mode, taking like real close photos of uh, like the dog's nose and just seeing the detail on their nose. Oh, that'd be good. It's it's just like a little bit less creepy than seeing the hairs on the kiwi fruit. A little bit less creepy. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, look, it is probably creepy. I'm the only one that's got a camera walking around the veggie aisle taking photos of small fruit. <laughs> I'd, I'd say so. But hey, we we all gotta do something, right? Oh, hey, we've got, we got go, someone else Gohan. in chat there. What's up, Gohan? Gohan. How you doing? Go Yo. Fernando. How you doing, man? 
First of all, love where, the name. I mean, I love, I love the name too. Grohan, where, uh, where are you coming to us from, mate? We've also seen people watching us now. Garden City. Welcome aboard, mate. Another Lots Queenslander? It's Garden sure City. Is. Ooh. This time, I think your oppo rep is Ben. I reckon I've heard Ben talking about Garden City before, yeah. Thanks, Roy. Benjamin, if you're still there, drop us a hello. Ben is an absolute legend. Yeah. How much is he paying you, Gohan? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta know because I need to know what the going rate is for, for for all the guys in my stores. Yeah. Oh, awesome! So, Gohan's actually from Vodafone and Springfield store. Fantastic. Awesome. Doesn't surprise me it's someone from Springfield, considering that's where Benjamin lives. But that's okay. Oh, is it? How are you going today, Gohan? Who's got a GoPro? I do not. No, you neither don't have do a GoPro? I. Oh, really? The two biggest gamers out there don't even have a GoPro. I do. Well, no, because I'm a gamer. No. I stay yeah, inside. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> GoPros are good for going outside. Yeah, that's true. I, I'll tell you why I bought a GoPro, right? For the anti-shake technology. When it first came out, I had to grab it. Um, especially when I was doing a bit of travel. <laughs> I'm getting like so I tra sorry. Like I travel everywhere. Um, but yeah, you used to use a GoPro quite a bit just for the anti shake, um, the stability and the quality. And since having this phone, I haven't even picked it up. I don't even know where it is, to be honest. Can um, I have it? No. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, yeah, you can have it, but I don't know why you would want to when our phone, the Find X2 Pro, already comes with the Ultra Steady Video 2.0. What does that do? Okay, I want you to pitch yourself in the city, running with your phone. On the left-hand side, you don't Am I it. running to someone or from someone? Let's say Steve was on the other end, and you're running to Steve. From? I can, I, I can just jog, that's cool. So yes, running, running with phone, yes. Did we just lose Neil? Yeah, we did. Okay. Oh no. Baby, come back! <laughs> oh. <laughs> I need that in. Steve, can you just keep an eye on Discord if you need to get him back into the channel, please? Yeah, I'm trying. Got him. Hello, Neil. Welcome back. Oh, hey. How you doing? <laughs> Jeez, I don't know what happened there. Oh, I got too excited and it kind of left me out. <laughs> um... So yes, um, you're running, running with phone. Oh, sorry, yes, yes, yeah, <laughs> that's why I got excited. Um, <laughs> Steve's on the other end, he's got his big arms open wide. Uh, you're running oh, running him. to him for a big cuddle, okay, yes. That's that. You've got cars walking on the side, walking, cars walking, how dumb is that? Cars driving on the side of you, you're running, you're sprinting. On the left-hand side, you're going to see the shake movement. Uh, it's going to be not very steady, you're not really going to be able to see where you're running to, if I'm watching you. Uh, however, with the Ultra City Video 2.0, the anti-shake technology that's been put into this is amazing. It's going to actually 
automatically stabilize, stabilize um, the video so that when you're running and I'm watching you run through the camera, it's smooth, it's elegant, it's pure quality. I see. So if it's a beautiful scene like me running into Steve's arms, is there also a way to then um, put that into slow-mo? Yes. And be really yes, cinematic about it? Oh, yes, there is. Oh. You know what? We've got this amazing app. Um, now, I may not even be saying it right, but this is how I say it. The loop. Oh. Um, and it will automatically create that video into something spectacular. Put a music in the put music in the background, add some sort of effect to it to what you've been trying to accomplish on that day. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. And you know what? You can actually auto generate a video where it does it automatically for you. Um, every now and then, I think once a week, it will send you notifications that it's created a video for you to see as well. Love I think it. that's really awesome. Yeah. Only available on Oppo devices. On the love it. Series. Double love it. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, do you guys take many videos out there, or usually just of my uh, my son running around like a madman doing something crazy that he definitely didn't learn from me. <laughs> yeah. How, how is your son, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, he's five and a half. Five and a half. Yeah. I don't know where they get their bloody energy from, to be honest. Um, my son goes to daycare, comes home at about six o'clock at night, and he's still running around. Yeah. yeah. I sit all day for work, and I'm bloody. Tell you what, now now he's I'm... going to school though. That that's all ended. He get he. I've had days where he's practically fallen asleep walking to the car from the school gate. Oh wow! I bet you love that. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Five years old though, eh? A good age. It can oh, be. I being fine. Yeah. <laughs> um. So Gohan, how are you today? How's your day going? And anybody else in chat, how are you? If you have not said hi to us yet, please do. How are you going there, Roy? He's just busy dominating and carrying my butt. Good, Matt. How are you? Yeah, good. Good. I'm just I'm just checking up to make sure you're doing all right. <laughs> I'm doing exactly what uh, Grant just said. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Kareem, you're still there, bud? Yeah, I'm still here, trying to <laughs> help someone. I don't know what it is about your voice, but you just make me laugh every time. <laughs> oh, I said the same thing. So. Uh, I thought she said that about your face. Uh, at times. <laughs> My camera's off. How's um How's the game going, guys? From my perspective, not so good. No. Not Great. this time. Last one went fine. Well, that's good. That's good. Got a question. I got another question out there for you, everyone. You would. Um, how do you how do you turn on macro mode? Ooh. It's a trick question. Oh, you can't tell them it's a trick question because then they know it's a trick question. I'm just, it could be. I'm just. <laughs> Or is the trick that you're saying it's a trick question, so it's oh. not really a trick question. You lost me in that question. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to send this question out to... Uh, let me pick. Um, let's go Benjamin. The tech guru. How would you turn on macro mode? Drop a DM. Tell me what you think. Unstoppable. Unstoppable. Rampage. Rampage. Double kill. Double kill. You could uh 
do your own voices for this. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Actually, you more remind me of the old school. You remember the Unreal Tournament voices? <laughs> yes. Yes, I do. Or just give it a bit of a round one fight. <laughs> That's more Tekken, though. I know, I know. You just, like, got the games all over the place, don't you? <laughs> See. What's that cool game? Um, and you used to be able to play it at the cinemas on those machines. Jeez, what was it called? Um, Pac-Man? Not Pac-Man. <laughs> it used to be a guy, and he used to shoot people. A little tiny man. <laughs> really doesn't narrow it down. Um, <laughs> Jeez, yeah. you do know video games, don't you? Oh shit! <laughs> Whoop. Um, no, I did. I did know what it was. I just Street yeah, Fighter. Ah, sure. oh, Street Fighter. Yeah, that was an awesome game, wasn't it? Still is. Yeah, it still is. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. It brings back a lot of memories. You know, hanging out at the local. Movie theater, jamming out some Street Fighter, eating some popcorn. I must say, I was by myself. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> I don't have friends. What's you that? So look at now? me now. Look at me now. I'm coming up in the world. <laughs> Let's go. Right, yeah, guys, Metal Gear Slug. Time go. <laughs> yeah, time to... Was it this game? Was it this game? <laughs> Oh dear. Metal Gear Slug. That's also a good game. Uh, and John's also saying Time Cop. I have no idea what Time Cop is. Might be from your era, Dom. Um, with the charging, with the fast charging, how convenient is it for you guys? Oh man, it's it's fantastic. Um, like especially, yeah. If you are just watching pure content for hours on end, and then you realise that you've gone to time where well, you're supposed to be going out, you're going, "Whoops, my phone's flat. That's fine." A few minutes on the charger and you laugh, and it's 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 the greatest. Don't have to leave your phone on charge all night and risk destroying your battery from from overcharging. It's you're laughing. Yeah, do you remember the days of, like, before you go out to the clubs or at the bars, you would have to, like, charge your phone for two hours? For hours, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, two hours of charge will give you, like... 40%. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and even then, by the time you get to one o'clock, two o'clock in the morning, you're trying to preserve it because you need to catch an Uber home. Oh, those were the days. Look at where we come now. Zero to Look 38 minutes now. where we come. 100%. Oh jeez. So guys in the chat, whoever's watching, what um what other games would you love to see us playing? Or would you even like to be playing with us or against us? Um We've had this suggestion of Call of Duty Warzone by Connor, so we'll definitely get onto that at some point in the near future. Um I know some of the guys from our team have, have said Uno would be great and I agree with that. What would you like to see from us? We, we can play anything and everything. Siege. Oof, I'd have to learn Ooh. how to play Siege. I, I want to learn how to play Siege. You play Siege yourself, Gohan? An enemy has been slain. He said, bruh, it's good, so good. So good, dude. Um, so, Gohan, a, a, a friend of mine, uh, must have been about two weeks ago, um, hosted a live event on Twitch where he was playing Siege with a bunch of the voice actors from Siege, um, including Martin Copping, who is Australian. He does the voice of Mozzie. You know, that diddly dee really annoying bloke. He's just as annoying in real life, let me tell you that. Um, but yeah, that, that was a really cool event. Um, 
they, and they just played a bunch of games with each other against each other. Um, had a few of the other voice actors from the states um, joined in by by Discord as well. It was a fantastic event. Um, I believe it was recorded and posted on the YouTube's. If you would like to, you should be able to find that. I reckon. But it was really cool to watch. They did a great job of it. Even Don saying it's great. That must be good. Siege is a fantastic game. I've just I haven't given it enough time myself. Yeah, maybe that's one that we could actually add to the top of the list. Um, you know, as a viewer of content, I'd love to see you guys play a bit of Siege. Oh, Don was platinum on Xbox for about a year. Nice. He's platinum high though. There's higher than Platinum, not, I believe. I'm not being a platinum is high, but I believe there's higher, I think. You have to let us know, Dom. Community is way too... Yeah, it is. It's a very, very toxic community. We'd probably have to turn uh, public game chat off. <laughs> <laughs> On stream. But to be fair, we'd probably have to do that with every single game that we play. True. Hey, Dom, are you back on deck with us yet? Yes. So we've got a bit of a theme so far. Everyone's wanting shooters. Siege, Warzone. I'm more than happy to give some Warzone content. It's going to be like awesome having a nice game of blackjack or something. <laughs> yeah, keep it simple. Bit of gambling on of, stream maybe, on company time, you reckon? Maybe put a bit of money in there, you know? There are, oh, there's two, two more above platinum. How many below? That's, because I know it's fairly high. How many ranks is there in total? I know Dom's keen for us to get into some Sea of Thieves. Four below. There's four below. Nice. And Gohan's going to check out your vids too. Awesome, man. Um, yeah, Gohan, the name... I think if you search... There you go, that's... I think if you search Duke of Flicks, you should find his YouTube channel and there'll be... I believe there's... clips of that on there. Otherwise, he's on Twitch. The video will be saved. You'll be able to watch on there as well. Awesome. I might even check that out too. Look at me learning. <laughs> I'm learning. Learning. So, tell me a story, guys. What else has been going on? I reckon it's about time you told us a joke. Oh, you don't want to hear my jokes, trust me. You don't want to hear them. Quite, quite, quite the opposite. Oh, you do want to hear them. Ooh. Uh, I've got to... I've got to... I've got to pick a... Yeah, Ben, great question. You're going to jump in with this. Uh, yeah, are you PC or console? How are you playing your siege? That's that's question number one. Look at me absolutely carrying there. I'm I'm, I'm incredible. Uh, <clears throat> All right. Well, this is while while he's thinking of an answer. Um, Pain true sex. He's... Now go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, go ahead. Gohan has said PS4. Um, here's a dad joke for you. Did you hear about the restaurant on the moon? The restaurant on the moon? Great food. No atmosphere. Did him. <laughs> da, made you laugh, Steve. Made you laugh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> made me also face palm and roll my eyes. 
So I take that as you will. <laughs> okay, here's another one. Here's right, another one. Okay. okay. Have to hear it what do you call an alligator in a vet? An investigator. Can we do like cricket sounds? So, um, now fade away into the bush. All in favor to uh, kick Neil. (laughs) Hey, Dom's back. Hey, Dom. Hey, mate. Welcome. Um, Hey, Dom. All right. Well, Roy, start up the next game. Um, Oh, Gohan, you're on PS4. Nice one. I love me a bit of PS4. Um, As a a fellow Dan. Come on, Ben. Come on, dude. Come on. Whose team are you on here? I appreciate um, you, Ben. Alright, so we'll, we're going to load up the next game. Whilst we're doing that, we're going to throw to a, another fantastic piece built by our very own Karim. Um, this next clip is on the... Um, so something Neil was speaking about earlier, the, the 12-bit slash Ultra Night mode. So we'll flick over to that now. Enjoy. With 12-bit true capture, you will enjoy the ability to take photos in raw format, which gives you rich and natural images, large dynamic range, high image processing accuracy, and more editing flexibility. Thanks to the Sony IMX 69 sensor, the Final Super Pro captures crisp and clear low light images with Ultra Night Mode 3.0. With Ultra Night Mode 3.0, algorithms apply to all three re lenses for epic night shots from any distance. Ultra Night Mode 3.0 also supports 10x hybrid zoom and up to 60x digital zoom. Thank you, Karim. Man, you just, you just, you're so good. You're so beautiful. Well presented. Well spoken. Thank you. Um, oh, what, what are we doing here? Do we back out? Yeah, we have to get Dom in. The boss man, let's go. So guys, if you're here hanging out, you've not yet hit that subscribe button, please do. Um, allow you yourselves to be notified of, of upcoming streams. We will be here weekly. Um, also, let us know, what do you think of this time slot, this 2 till 4 p.m. on a Thursday? Um, do you think it works well? Is there a different time slot you think could work better? Let us know. Let us know. We're open to suggestions. And if there's anyone from our team that you would love to see involved in the stream also, let us know. Throw them under the bus. What about requests to have people removed? Yes. <laughs> Am I being removed? Oh, yeah. mm, it's, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> I, I see where this is going, Steve, and it's not working. <laughs> Good afternoon, Dom. How you doing? Yeah, not bad, man. How about you? doing alright being picked on by Steve what do you mean I was the only one that laughed at your joke it was a pity you're laugh. the only face I could see <laughs> oh, that's probably a good thing there man no why because I'm so pretty <laughs> <laughs> I'm not hearing any disagreement. It's not it's, worth. I'll give it. I'll give don't want to hurt I'll your feelings. <laughs> I'd need feelings for them to be hurt. True. 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 Hashtag burn. <laughs> I'm just going to take myself to the bathroom while this game loads. In the meantime, you guys can have a look at Neil's beautiful face in this game. There you go, Neil. You don't care. <laughs> that little laugh. <laughs> hey guys, how you doing? Um, as you probably know, my name is Neil. I am uh, the account executive for Queensland, or one of them, and my co-partner Benjamin is the other side. Um, yeah, like... What an amazing adventure this has been so far, right? We've been 78 minutes into this, and I think it's going well. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think it's it's been good. Yeah, it's going well. It's going well, good banter. Loving the commitment from everyone out there. 
Um, one thing I'll say, though, is if I can get every one of us to like um, this stream, that'd be awesome. Um, and like Grant was saying before, please subscribe. We've got some amazing stuff happening. So, be awesome. I th Thank you, oh, Patrick. Patrick, I think it's been spectacular and fantastical. <laughs> Patrick, Thank I you, think Pat. you have a flair for the dramatic. Leave Pat alone. <laughs> hey, I didn't say it was a bad thing. Ooh, what did I miss? What's been fantastical and spectacular? Ah, uh, just Patrick. <laughs> oh, himself? Yeah. Yeah, himself. I see. Ah, she. Well, it's that time again. I've got a question for you all. Who's ready? Here's a good in one. Us or y'all is in the chat? Y'all is in everyone. Ooh. Ooh. Who created our custom sensor? We'll leave it for the chat for a little bit, and then if they've got no answers, we can jump in. Sounds groovy. <laughs> Where do you guys want me? Top, bottom, middle? Uh, I've gone mid. I'm bottom. Oh, okay. I'll go top. Dream's <laughs> gonna come take last hits. Yeah. Not a top, but you're on the well. well, shouldn't money is go bottom? Yeah. I don't know. What, you think I can't handle this myself? Yep. <laughs> no. I'll come bottom. I trust Grant. <clears throat> I um I saw the look on your face just then. <laughs> <laughs> Turn my camera off. <laughs> Speaking of, do you guys want to keep seeing Neil's beautiful face or my not so beautiful face? No, they they they're liking your face, mate. Um, and they're liking my conversation. I mean, Patrick is Patrick's liking my face. I feel like it's a company from Japan. Well, Dom, over to you, mate. Oh, Pat's really pushing it, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Is Pat still on probation? Or... <laughs> well, look, we're, we're coming into our... Connor's being funny, too. Oh, Connor's actually on to this one. Has responded quickly and said the correct answer of Sony. You're right, mate. Connor just knows that. things. Oh, I reckon Connor's got the inside maybe. scoop from Neil here. Or, or it could be me teaching him yesterday. Mm, I, I right reckon is. inside scoop. <laughs> yeah, he seems pretty knowledge. switched on. And you can only get that switched on if you train by the mode. The what? Which brings which 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 brings me to Modi's the what? View. Oh, okay. I, oh, am I not allowed to give myself a nickname now? Sure. No, you're not. No. <laughs> <laughs> you asked about pet being on probation. Well, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, see, drop the stuff. I'll see you later then. <laughs> that backfired Thank on you, you a little bit, Neil. <laughs> it, well, you know what? I don't have to listen to the bearded coconut. <laughs> Well, well, I do because he is my just boss. Sounds like know. a racial slur without knowing <laughs> the yeah. username. Oh, look. <laughs> well, this, this, is, this is the great thing about the Ozo family, right? We're all allowed to have great banter. Um, we're not always all about work. We're all um, one big, huge, happy family. Wouldn't you say so? Yes. I took that username Bearded Coconut because it had it been taken on quite a few different platforms and I was like, cool, that's mine now. I like it, I quite like it. I like it. <laughs> it resembles Dom to a T. <laughs> you know, it just, it, yeah. I thought you actually came up with that by yourself. But... I did, along with trying to, every name that wasn't taken. <laughs> I can't imagine taking photos of this camping scenery with the Times 2 Pro. Ooh, that'd be nice. If only you had one. If only you had one, Connor. 
Oh. There he go again. Dying. <laughs> but look, Connor, you're doing an amazing job. You're staying in this chat. You're being productive. Um, even though you're away camping with minimal signal. Legend. Um, we, we appreciate your time. Really do. Um, like I was saying before, so brings me we're 83 minutes into this and i think it's time for modi's review all right all right i can't even bring myself to repeat it but all right i, 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 sure. I do like it y'all 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 all laughing but it's honest i've got three reasons ladies and gentlemen it. introducing <laughs> modi's reviews i really wish if james was online right now he would back me up that's not a good James, thing. James, are you there? Nope, he's not. Okay. Uh, well, look, three reasons why I would buy a fine series device. Uh, one is for capture. So you've got the camera qualities there with the tri setup. Two, entertainment. I love the 120 hertz, as I was saying before. And three, convenient. That fast charging with the SuperVoo 2.0 is a special something you know having that zero to 100 percent in 38 minutes why would you need a wireless charger when you can have this right honestly very cool um, very very true if you guys had to choose one key aspect out of the whole phone what would you choose grant i'll start with you like a, a favorite feature sorry yeah favorite feature out of the whole phone can i say entertainment as a feature you sure can. All right, entertainment. Overall entertainment. entertainment. Oh, and James is online. Hey, Oppo crew. Oh, hey, hey James. Jimmy. Speak of the devil, and he shall appear. Mm, see what you've done. You did. <laughs> you, you, I'm you, blaming you, Modi reviews. I'm blaming. Yeah. <laughs> hey, leave my boy alone. <laughs> I got your back, Jimmy. Jimmy. God, you're just Jimmy. coming out with all the weird names, aren't you? What's wrong with Jimmy? James is short for Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy. If you say so. <laughs> James, James, James reminds me of Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> Whoever watched that. <laughs> Alright, I'll pay that. Uh, Patrick. Oh, James retracted a message. And did not miss us oh, anymore. He, oh. he said missed you guys, and then we started talking about him, and he just <laughs> deleted it. <laughs> Uh, for you guys that don't know, James is our training manager. Um, he's the one that, behind the scenes, making sure you guys have all the knowledge you need to sell these phones in your store. So, guys, tell us, what, what games would you like to see James attempting to play? Let us know. We'll make it happen. Attempting to play. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Grant. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Patrick's key feature is the Superboot 2.0, um, and it's because it's so convenient. What about you, Dom? You're a hard-working man that's always on your phone. Um, what's the key feature for you? There's so many on the Find X2, bro. One of the uh, main features is obviously <clears throat> what Pat's mentioned, Superboot Super 2.0. Yep. But um, to be honest with you, it's just the battery. It's a uh, it's a really good battery for me. I can get up to about six hours screen on time, um, and I'm a heavy user. So to be able to achieve that, and knowing that um, I can easily top up a battery super fast, is super important to me with everything that I've got to do, which is usually on my phone constantly, helping everyone everyone out on the team uh, managing different projects. So um, good battery life and quick char quick charge times. Awesome. Yeah, you're a busy man that's always on their phone, so I'm assuming you'd get smashed in battery pretty, pretty fast. Um, can, I, can I ask you, do you charge your phone more than once a day? No, luckily I take my phone off at about, so I'm up at 4.30 in the morning, yep. and I take it off at 4.30, and it's usually pretty good till about, oh, you know, it's, it's good till I go to bed, which is usually 4.30, 9.30, 10. 
Why are you up so early? 4.30. Training, dude. Training. Damn. You can't, you can't look that good without a bit of work, you know? <laughs> Plus I get more stuff done in the morning and then we, uh, just be more time to spend with you guys. Oh yeah. Oh nice. Uh, what about you, Karim? I want to say fast charging, but it's been taken too many times now. Not really. If that's if that's oh, your it's it's like, it's it's key feature, yeah. yeah. It's one of the key features. Well, no, it's like, I think. But I guess I'm just playing a uh, hurt display it makes it better. Mhm. Mm uh, I'm just gonna. Well, here's, yeah, here's a good. different question for you, Karim. Why would you choose the fine series? Can you say that again? <clears throat> Why would you choose the fine theory? In, in the phones, rather than something like uh, from other devices that I've used. Yeah, yeah. Like I've used yeah. So you've obviously used the Reno. Uh, yeah. Even the Reno. Um, Reno was a beautiful phone. I love the pop-up camera and everything, but. Just the fine series, something about like the screen, the design, and everything about it is just immaculate, in my opinion. Mm. Yeah, awesome. And you, do you use the Find X2 Pro as like your uh, main handset? Yep. Yeah, cool. Awesome. Um, I definitely use mine as my main handset as well. Um, you know, for all the features that I said before. The camera quality, you know, having the 120 hertz, um, and the convenience yeah. of the super boot. I honestly wouldn't have it any other way. It kind of makes you wonder what more can you do in a phone, but I'm sure there's more. Thank you, James. I do rock. <laughs> Neil, next time you say that, you've got to do the whole as in on TV. But wait, there's more. <laughs> but wait, there's more. <laughs> I could do that in an Indian accent too for you if you like. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, there's more. Thank you. <laughs> that, was just, that was a bit shocking. I had something in my throat. Um, yeah. So Dom, tell me a story. What's been going on in your world? Stories. <laughs> Nothing's been going on in his world. No any good stories. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's probably because uh, he went that path because telling a joke didn't go so well. <laughs> I wasn't here for that. Why? Well, I had to have the joke go because I mean, yeah, give give us a, give us another joke now. An attempt was what? made. <laughs> You guys all hating on my damn bad joke. Ben likes it. That's the main thing. <sighs> Someone had to. You've got James Look, here now. He'll is, he'll like your jokes is, as well. This is a quest. This is a joke for Steve. Um, why did the scarecrow win an award? Because he was outstanding in his field. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hey, so that? anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's all we've got time for today. <laughs> well, well, well. Um, hey, I thought that was a good joke, especially because, you know, we work out in the field and all. Uh, I'm in Victoria. But you know what? Speaking of awards, did you know Oppo's won 2018, 2019 and 2020 CanStar Award? Really? Yeah, yeah. And that's something to be proud of. Honestly, um, and it's only because we're the Australia's we're Australia's most satisfied phone manufacturer. Not come, oh yeah. Who wouldn't want a durable phone? Something that's value for money. You you join us, James? For what? What are you joining us? What are you doing? Let's go, guys. Who else is out there? Please comment in the chat. We'd like to hear from you. 
We've got six lights, but 14 people watching. Click on that like button. It's calling more, your name. More importantly, the subscribe button so you get notified when uh, when we go live next. That makes sense, doesn't it? I bet you guys are uh, enjoying seeing Neil's face over mine now, though, right? Much more, much more. They soothing. are. I'm not. <laughs> I'm looking at my face. I'm thinking I've got to get back to the gym. So thank hey, you for that. Don, we were we were talking NFL earlier. You're you're a, you're a Pats fan, are you? Where are we? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Patriots fan. So, uh, what yeah, what was yeah. your reason for for following? the Pats when you decide to take up, take up a team? Um, let me think. I had a couple of mates that lived over in that neck of the woods over in America. Mm -hmm. They were Pats fans. <clears throat> and, um, let me think. I think I was a Cowboys fan way back when. Sure, like, yep. So well, I mean, if you think, like, back in the day, if there was ever any NFL on TV, it was pretty much Patriots or Cowboys. Yeah. So, I mean, that, and that's why there is so many Cowboys and Pats fans in, in you know, Australia and New you know, Zealand. you got to think about the uh, the Buccaneers now, that Tom Brady's... Tom uh, Brady, yeah. Dover. And, I mean, hey, I play a lot of Sea of Thieves, so it makes sense. <laughs> so, you're going to make a switch to the Bucks? Just, uh, just follow follow Tom Brady and just continue that pirate life. So you're, you're a Tom Brady's fan, a Tom Brady fan rather than a Patriots fan. Yeah, Tom How Brady. do you think he's going to go at the Bucks? Honestly, I don't know. Yeah, I, I feel like he was very much a, a system QB. Like he played Belichick's system really well. Uh, don't get me wrong; he's an incredible quarterback. I have totally lost top. <laughs> oh, yes. How old is Tom Brady? He's been around for 40... a while. 40... something? Early 40s? Wow. What about you, Grant? Who do you follow? Uh, I am well, the Baltimore the Ravens. Oh, very nice. Yes. What's your reasoning? Uh, I like purple. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you know what you remind me of then? You remember the like video toidles. from ages ago, the kid just going, I like turtles. I like, I like toidles. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's um, my input. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, like, uh, yeah, but, but real talk, like, I, I, I like purple, and, um, I, I, yeah, it's, I guess similar to you, I had a couple of friends that supported them back yeah. then, and, um, and they were, uh, that was about 2011, I think I jumped on them, so... They were a half decent team then, and um, it's been a rough. We had a bit of a rough patch, but um, looking pretty good now. I'm I'm pretty excited for what the next few years are going to look like. That's awesome to hear that you know, outside of this line of work, we all have something that we follow and have hobbies. Um, it's not always about work, right? We have true. a work life and a personal life, and it's good that we can, you know, sometimes separate work and personal life and just focus on something that's not related to mobile phones, like you could say. Very um, true. What about you, Karim? What do you, what do you, what are your some of your hobbies? Charging people for cheese. <laughs> Nah, just going to the gym, man, honestly. Yeah, you're all about that gym life. Balkan, bro. Exactly. Balkan, bro. Balkan, bro. I don't see it, Karim. <laughs> when you get that, oh. Yeah, I've, um, I've been Balkan for a few years. Oh, yeah. That family pack, man. <laughs> <laughs> Got that family Dom, Dom will notice. 350 KFC snack box, right? That's the bulking pack. I don't need KFC. <laughs> what? But, but no, Neil said you would know. Neil's yeah. wrong. 
He's lying. He's lying. He won't care seeing you. You ask Marvin. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't need it. Marvin. And what does he do? He's the heart and soul. Heart and soul, eh? Marvin the Martian. That is a great Alrighty. Adrian's character. And I love the banter between him and Daffy Duck. <laughs> they were on Space Jam together, weren't they? Um... Yeah, yeah, they were. I think so, yeah. Actually, mm. Marvin the Martian in Space Jam? Yeah. Oh, I think it was a very brief appearance. He's not not one of the main characters. I, I feel like pretty much the whole crew were in there, like at least in the in the crowd. Yeah, I'm not gonna pretend like it. I'm pretty sure it's been at least 15 years since I've seen that. Yeah. Honestly, it's on Netflix, so watch that on your phone. 120 hertz. Bad. It's based. It oh good. yeah, it is on Netflix now. Um, it sure is. My son watches it um, every day. If you do use the motion. We uh, our Netflix app is locked to 60 hertz, so you'll get 60 frames per second, which is still better than what you would usually get, which is around about 30. Yeah. Oh, okay, awesome. It's so clear you don't even know. Well, that's it, man. It's very, very clear. Everything. Do you watch? Do you watch a lot of Netflix and sports on your phone? I know this was a topic before, but... Yeah, I can see a lot of media on my um, device, so... Super important that the screen is very clear, very big, so mm. I can see more content. And, um, we actually deliver on all of that. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Like, that's probably, like, the biggest thing for me with this phone is just the screen and what you can actually do with the screen, you know? Um, especially because everything we do nowadays is all on our phone, whether it's doing worksheets or you know, watching something on Netflix or YouTube. It's, it's, it's part of my life. And when I don't have a device like this with me, to be honest, I feel naked. I honestly do. I feel like a part of me is actually missing. I don't know about how you guys feel, but yeah. The technology has taken us. Um, I can't leave the I can't leave the house without my phone. Yeah, yep. Yeah, it's crazy, right? It's one yeah, of the phone, that, wallet, uh, keys, face mask. You know, before you leave the house. <laughs> yeah, if it, you don't even need you don't even need your wallet. Oh, you don't even need your phone. wallet. What do you need your wallet for? just a part of me same as my phone yeah okay Shut down. he values uh spending cash you know <laughs> spending cash you need to have cash okay <laughs> <laughs> And that concludes Neil for this conversation with, and <laughs> I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Um, yeah, look, I use my phone for a lot of online shopping as well. Um, to be honest, I find it easier to, to shop and use Uber Eats on my phone than my tablet. Yeah, I think that's that's one of the um, <clears throat> great things about technology and with the Find X2 Pro. Shopping is a lot easier. Um, and I find myself on it constantly, especially I've got 5G in my network. Uh, sorry, in my neighborhood. And I'm just sitting there constantly trying to... I really shouldn't, but I'm always online. Doing something. Buying something. Yeah, wow. And do you find we're using a 5G on your phone, it chews up a lot of battery life? It, it, I don't know. Honestly, I have I still get between four and five hours when I'm running everything, whether it's your um, 120 hertz, your motion <clears throat> um, enhancement with the Zero One Ultra Vision Engine, um, 5G. Yeah, I still get four to five hours. This depends on how I'm using it. I have no issues. Yeah, that's fair.
Yeah, that's 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 pretty awesome. I I recently used five G on our device and the speeds are just incredible. To be honest, I haven't actually used anything quicker than a five G network on a device. So, how about everyone else around the country? Have you got five G as well, or Grim Pat? I don't have it in my immediate neighbourhood, but not too far away. There's a few patches. Okay. Have you tested it out on your device? Yeah, it's it's sensational. It's fantastic. Awesome. James, was that a yep to being there or a yep to being in a five G area? Oh, just recently. Yeah, nice. Yeah, cool. How'd you find it, James? I bet you're getting a lot more work done now with that fast internet, eh? Faded. James has left the conversation. <laughs> MBN is redundant. Yeah, that's so true. Um, I've got MBN at my place at the moment and my 4G speeds on the device are actually quicker than my MBN. Hence why I do everything off my phone. Um, just for reliability. At least I know that when I start something it's going to save. Um, rather than using computer and halfway through it cuts out. That's a good point. Very good point. Yeah. Um, believe it or not, I actually use my phone to hotspot a lot as well. So, yeah. You know, I've got a few how, where... how do you find your battery life when you're hotspotting? Uh, it's actually not too bad. It's only if I hotspot for a while. Um, I know I'm getting at least three hours or so. Well, that's all I've tested it for, of hotspotting. But um, if I'm just doing quick hotspots to say, let's if I'm trying to print something or whatever it is, um, yeah, no effect to the battery at all. Yeah, right. Um, yeah, that's, it's, it's all these small features that kind of make me really enjoy the phone you know true something that you don't really think about when you're going to buy a phone either um i know when i bought phones in the past it's more like what's the camera like what's this like what's that like you don't think about how you'll really use the phone um yeah and that's what i guess makes my decision now how i'm actually gonna use my phone whether it's uh research or taking photos, um, uploading, downloading, um, all these factors take into play. Yeah, very true. Um, yeah, and having a screen size with the Find X2 Pro definitely helps. How's um, everyone doing out there? Is Gohan still with us? Yeah, so guys, it looks like this will probably be our last game of the session, so um, you're going to have to let us know if you're out there. Yeah, it's uh, looking like we're about to lose. It's not looking flash right now, is it? Oh, gee. Losing's never good. She really wanted you dead, hey, Roy? <laughs> Rough. Yeah, it's a bit different when Roy plays a character he hasn't played before, hey? <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so we're going to go to our final piece of Karim content. Um, the next piece we're going to look at is on the um, 10 times slash ultra macro mode. So sit back and enjoy. The Find X2 Pro uses all three cameras for different focal lengths to achieve 10 times hyper zoom and 60 times pixel zoom. So zooming on the Find X2 Pro is much more clearer and smoother than ever before. The 48 megapixel high definition camera lets you capture the macro level. 
So if you haven't used the macro mode before, you've got to try it. The camera will automatically switch to ultra macro mode when a subject is less than 10 centimeters away. This feature can work really well for subjects as tiny as a player brass, which can be magnified up to eight times this focal length. So I mean that's what Neil touched on on earlier the the with the auto with the macro mode kicking in automatically. I think that's an incredible feature on the handset. I don't know about you guys, but I think that's huge. Absolutely. Oh, definitely. Um, you know, being able to zoom in on quality fruits is yeah. Not let's be honest, not just fruits, even oh, outside fruits. grass. Um, you know, you're sitting outside having a cheeky beer. I really want you guys over the weekend to have a go at it. Um, I think you guys will really enjoy it. Absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Absolutely. Well, that just about wraps up. Um, unless you guys don't want to end on a loss. Nah, I think I think that'll probably Happy do us. Wrap? Beautiful. Yeah. All right. So, guys, thank you so much for joining us on our first official um, stream here. Um, please hit up any of your um, local account executives. Let us know um, any feedback, um, any games you'd like to see us playing, um, anything, anything like that. Let us know. We're, we're open to suggestions, open to feedback, criticism. Let us know. Um, if you haven't yet hit that subscribe button, please do. Um, get notifications of when we are next to go live. Um, at this point in time, though, I think it's safe to say that we'll see you at 2 p.m. Thursday next week. Is that is that... Is that fair to say, guys? Yeah. Yeah, sure is. Sounds good. And, and, yeah. and as Grant touched on before, hit like, subscribe, and you'll get a notification from us. That's it. Um, absolutely. Um, Neil, thank you so much for, for jumping in and having a chat with all of us today. Love those oh, Modi no. reviews. No, my pleasure. Those Modi reviews, reviews will be available online and on your Fibber News tonight at 6 p.m. Thank you. <laughs> Do you have a website? <laughs> no sponsorship. No sponsorship, no, sorry. Um, contact Jim, James Delaney. <laughs> Delaney. Delaney, oh, we got a new Delaney. James. <laughs> About time we got a new James, let me tell you. I don't think you heard the T at the end. Delaney. <laughs> okay. Delaney. <laughs> <laughs> Roy, thanks for the carries. No worries. Sorry about that last game. I had no idea how to play that guy. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty sure I attributed to that loss. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a team game. We all we all uh, added to the loss. Yeah, absolutely. Not me. I just watched. Well, well, you, know, well you did nothing then. You distracted <laughs> us. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> um, Sayonara. Karim, thank you for going AFK. Appreciate it. Always. <laughs> Dom, thanks for jump, jumping in in the end there. Yeah, no worries, man. And Steve, thanks. Just no thanks. worries. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, th thanks for joining us, mate. Appreciate it. Um, guys, everybody who has come through today, thank you so much. Um, it's been an absolute pleasure. Um, hopefully entertaining you all a little bit. Hopefully you are... Uh, Learned a thing or two. Um, thanks for coming and hanging out. And we will see you all again next week. Is there anything else you guys want to add before we wrap? I'll, I'll take that as a no. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Guys, thank you very much. We'll see you next week, Thursday, 2 p.m. Until then. <laughs>